we're standing here today we're listening to these children read from the charter a piece of paper that was put in place to protect each and every one of us from corrupt government hearing those children speak and read it is heartbreaking I'm not going to pretend it's not because it is what is happening today is heartbreaking and I'm not going to pretend it's not because each and every one of you know it is the first time I stood on these steps I stood here and I told you who I am I told you I was the granddaughter of a great chief the daughter of a First Nations woman who was a survivor from the residential school system the daughter of an immigrant your neighbor and these children stood here today and they talked about what they loved about Canada and who we are as Canadians that piece of paper and everything we've seen corrupted but this goes on and runs much deeper than these past two years I've walked through this crowd and I looked you guys in the eye today and I would not be doing you any service if it, I did not allow myself to speak truth we need real solutions we need to speak the truth and we need to educate ourselves on what is truly going on. Yeah. It goes much, much deeper. Yeah. And we know this. So what solutions do we have? Because this goes beyond Canada. This is global. Yeah. We need a global difference. We need real solutions, and if we keep coming and doing the same things over and over and over and expecting different results, that's insanity. So what do we do? There are people, and I will tell you, I will tell you, and I'm going to speak it right here, and this might be the last time I'm invited to speak, but I will speak truth. Yeah. There are real people out there who are creating parallel societies under corporations because they know the only way forward is to do it under maritime law, international law. Smart people, real people with real solutions. I appreciate what everybody else is doing, but it's only slowing it down. They have corrupted our food systems, our education, our health, they have infiltrated on every level our councils, our reserves, our police systems. Everything, Everything is corrupted. Here, here. And if you want real solutions, you need to take it into your hands and you need to do the work. We need to come together now because the window is closing. That's right. right. They mean to bring down the world population. By 2030, that's eight years, they are assaulting our food right now as we speak. Yes. And many of us, we don't want to hear these truths. Yes. But I would not be doing you a service if I stood here and did lip service. I will not dishonor my voice. I will not dishonor my elders, my guides, my ancestors, and I will not dishonor you. In yeah. your faith, in your hope, in your trust. Yay, Serena! I had five minutes today, and I wonder what will I say that can make a difference. I will not keep the truth from you. If you want to move forward and be a part of the solution, then come and speak to me. But I disagree. You can disagree. You know what? That's our freedom, guys. That's what freedom is. We have the freedom to keep doing the same things over and over and expecting a different result. We have the freedom to bury our head in the sand. We have the freedom to do whatever the heck we want to do. But if you choose to move forward and
and take your life and your destiny into your hands, then do it. Come on. Woo!